SPFalcons.com. Here with Gilles Derricks after a 69-52 home win over Northwest Nazarene. Gilles, your thoughts on this victory? Uh, I thought it was a good win for us. Everybody played really hard. We still didn't shoot the ball as good as we wanted to, but uh, we made up for it in other, you know, in other areas like defense and in the rebounding uh, area. Your team was up 30 to 24 at halftime. By that point, you already had a double double with 12 points and 12 rebounds. What were, why are you so effective in the first half? Um, honestly, I just focused on playing hard and you know rebounding the ball and kind of let the other stuff you know come to me. I know the guys are gonna find me uh, on offense, so I decided just to focus on just, you know the stuff I can control and play hard, and the other stuff would just come to me. Is there some added incentive for a big guy like you that if you get an offensive rebound, more than likely you're able to go right back up and get an easy two? Yeah, I mean that's always nice, you know, because some, you know, the guards sometimes you know they miss you, not you know, not on purpose, but um, you know it's always you know it's a, it's great to get an offensive rebound, you know, because you're as a big guy, big guys want you to rebound and you know you get yourself a bucket, so it's always nice. Yeah. Well, you finished with 20 points and a uh, SPU high for you, 17 rebounds. Uh, you feel like this is your best game in an SPU uniform? Yeah, I think so. Um, I think there's room for improvement. I mean, I missed, I missed a couple easy ones that I, sh I shouldn't have missed, and you know, could have grabbed even a couple more rebounds. I think, but I, I, you know, I'm, pr I'm pretty happy with the result, and we got a win. So. Yeah. Well, you guys had a nine-game winning streak, and then you lost three. Now you're back on the winning ledger, and you won three in a row. Do you feel like you're you're back in the groove? Yeah, I feel like things are starting to come together again for us. We kind of, you know. Um, we're, the, we're the team that, we're, that we were before those games, um, and it's, it's showing on the court right now, so I think we're, we're on the right track. Well, you play again on Tuesday and uh, against St. Martin's here at home. You're in a stretch of four games in eight days. Uh, is that a, a tiring for you, or is it, what are your thoughts on that? Yeah, I mean, it does take a toll on our, like, you know, on our bodies, uh, you know, but the coaches do a good job, you know, they can practice a little shorter, and then, you know, it's, part of it is up to us. We've got to take care of our bodies, you know. Um, so. Well, you, uh, SB runs a real system here, uh, the, the swing offense. How are you feeling? Do you feel like now you're you're in the kind of in the groove here and, and feeling comfortable with this, or is there still room to go? Yeah, I definitely feel more comfortable with it now. Like I'm kind of starting to you know pick my spots and see where my opportunities can be in the offense better. Uh, so I think it's, you know that's why it's working a little better for me right now. Uh, one thing I noticed tonight, you're a, a very good passer. A lot of times you'll get doubled more often than not, and you're able to take it right back out. Has that always been a good part of your game? Uh, yeah, I like to pride myself a little bit. You know, that I'm a pretty decent passer. You know. I still got to eliminate some turnovers, you know, can't, can't have those, but, you know, I'd like to think I'm a pretty decent passer. Yeah. Well, thank you very much. Congratulations on a great game, and uh, we'll see you on Tuesday night. Sounds good. Thanks.